Hello everyone, welcome back to the Wisconsin Greg Show today. Uh, I got a little, I'm going to do a little sampling of some Mary Jane. Um, it's out of Lufkin, Texas. And oh no, it's not the Mary Jane you're thinking of. This is some Mary Jane candy. Uh, it's got real molasses and peanut butter. Uh, so we're going to do a little sampling today and see how that turns out. <coughs> um, let me read a little bit of what it says on the bag here. Uh, it says uh, the Atkinson Candy Company has nearly a century of experience handcrafting the best peanut butter candies that uh, that's why we're excited to bring back the iconic Mary Jane candies. Iconic Mary Jane candies. Mary Jane features fresh made peanut butter, real molasses, and a new easy open bite sized chew. So dig in and enjoy some famous flavor that makes Mary Jane great. It's kind of cool. Um, I'm not getting paid to do this uh, sampling or review. Uh, I just happened to stumble across this product on uh, YouTube on another channel. Uh, one guy was giving some uh, cop a hard time. He just had this in a bag and asked him if he wanted some Mary Jane. And I thought it was pretty funny, so I'm like, I gotta check that out and see if there really is such a thing. And there was, and I uh, ended up getting this on Amazon. Uh, so I thought I'd try it out and see what it's like. Uh, I haven't had molasses for years. Since I was younger, I tried to make some stuff out of molasses myself. So it'll be interesting to try out. Um, it's got all the nutrition facts on the back. Uh, eight pieces of this is one serving, what they consider. Um, so... I'll leave a picture of the bag and uh, the serving uh, calories and all that stuff here for you to look at. I'll do that right now. I'll put that in the video. Um, it says on here that it's... Uh, made with a lot of stuff that's uh, uh people are allergic with so like if you're allergic to peanut butter um uh let's see what else does it say and it's also made in a facility that has milk eggs and tree nuts um and that's about it so if you're allergic to stuff like that you'll want to stay away from here um but anyways uh there was a tag on the back that's, uh, I believe it's an Amazon tag, I'm not sure though, it says it's best by 10 of 18, 10, 18 of 22, but then on the bag it says it's good, best by November 18 of 22, so I don't know Amazon put that on there or what the deal is, but I'd go by what's on the bag myself. Um, it's actually stamped on the bag and not a sticker. So anyways, uh... Kind of interesting, I thought it was kind of a cool thing. It's kind of in the shape of uh, Tootsie Rolls. Um, it's packaged and wrapped the same way Tootsie Rolls are, so it kind of even feels like the same consistency of Tootsie Rolls by me squeezing it here a little bit. I haven't tried these yet, so it'll be interesting to see what they, what they taste like. Um, so, I'm gonna dig in here and uh, see how, it, how they taste. I don't think I'll be having eight of them in one serving. That sounds pretty generous, but we'll see. Maybe it's one of those things like potato chips. You can't have just one, so I don't know. So, yep, unwraps the same way as uh, Tootsie Rolls. It actually looks uh, pretty much like a Tootsie Roll, just a little bit lighter in color. Uh, let me bring this up to, the, your, up to the camera and show you. That's going to focus or not. And that's the empty wrapper. So, let's see if we can get this in my big old mouth here. Trying to rush it along here because of the video, um, but um, it's pretty sweet. Um, <laughs> it 
it's very, very similar to Tootsie Rolls. But I think the molasses changes the flavor a little bit. I'm not sure what Tootsie Rolls are made out of myself. They're okay, pretty good. If you like Tootsie Rolls, I think you'll definitely like these. Yeah. Um, it's stuck to my teeth right now. But anyways, um, yeah, they're pretty decent product. Um, I thought, oh, well, that's a small amount, but it, it'll last you quite a while. I think eight pieces will last you. That's a very good serving. Um, I'd say maybe four, four pieces would be a serving myself. But yeah, if you like Tootsie Rolls, I'm definitely thinking you're going to like them. Um, I would give them a... I'd say a four thumbs up. Um, I give like a five thumbs up is the best you can get, and a four thumbs down is the worst you can get, and anywhere in between there. So five thumbs up is the best. I give this about a four thumbs up. So that's pretty good. So I think the name is what sells it. Kind of interesting name, unusual. Um, Got to kind of watch out for them Marys out there. <laughs> But anyways, uh, Mary Jane is the name of the candy, and I gave it a four thumbs up. So I hope you enjoyed this little review, and uh, go out and get yourself some. I know they sell it on Amazon. If I remember, I'll try to leave the link in the description if you're interested in trying it. So uh, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the next Wisconsin Greg Show. Bye now.